I believe that college baseball is the best baseball experience for fans anywhere, and I've got seven reasons to improve that. Hey guys, it's Josh, the 90 Know-It-All, coming to you today to talk about why I think college baseball is the best experience uh, for baseball for a fan. Uh, it just, it really is. And I'll explain to you, i got seven reasons why, but before we jump into that, guys, take a moment, click like on this uh, video. It actually helps for uh, YouTube to kind of spread it out so more baseball fans will see it. Uh, don't forget to leave a comment below on what level you think is the best for the fan experience and subscribe to the channel so that way you're up to date when new videos come out from not any know-it-all so guys right off the bat i love college baseball anyone who knows me and has been around me knows that i, I love baseball as a whole but i love college baseball i've been covering it uh, pretty hard for the last five six seven years uh, it's just been something i enjoy doing do a lot of photographs a lot of interviews and really it's because college baseball has become my favorite go-to level for baseball. Now, the first reason why I have for that is because the talent. You're talking about the best players across all the high schools combined into college level talent. You know, and so you're gonna have guys who can hit, guys who can run, guys who can throw. It's not gonna be that comedy of errors type of baseball that you see uh, played at the high school level, certainly played at Babe Ruth and, and Little League type of level. You're gonna see games that you know are come down to fundamentals, games that come down to making smart decisions on the base path, making smart baseball decisions uh, defensively. And that's what I like to see. I like to see that. That's why I like the upper levels, uh, whether it be college, w uh, minor league, or even major league baseball, because the game comes down to the fundamentals, comes down to the decisions that the players make on the field. And it's not, once again, that comedy of errors. You do get games where there are lots of errors and it turns into that. But most of the games are, are won or lost by good hitting and good defense. And that's what I love to watch. I like that level of talent. So that's the first thing. You know, yes, minor league baseball, probably going to have some higher level of talent, higher level of games being played. But I've been to minor league games where the errors are just everywhere. Just guys can't feel the ball, can't throw. So that's why, you know, I don't put the college level that far below minor league baseball. So I love doing that. The second reason why I love college baseball, because it's affordable. Most of the games, now there are some Division I schools that charge pretty good prices for their tickets, but you're talking about the large majority of colleges that have baseball programs, their tickets are not that expensive. Maybe five bucks to get into a game, sometimes not even that much. A lot of teams don't really have a way to charge people because the field's open. You really can just walk in anywhere you want to. So you can actually watch a game for free. So that's that's pretty cool. That's pretty nice. And one of the things I love about college baseball, you know, it's affordable. It's not overpriced. You can afford to take your family if you want to. Or if you just want to go catch a game on a nice, you know, warm afternoon, you can do that. So the affordability of college baseball is also nice. Once again, I know there are some D1 programs that they're not cheap to get into, but, you know, there's some aspects as to, you know, why they charge much. They're national contenders, that type of stuff. But, you know, there's lots of other teams, lots of other places you can go watch games. And that actually leads into number three. One of the reasons why I love college baseball is because it's local. I don't have to drive two hours to watch a game. Yes, I could drive two hours to go catch some games. But really, for me, I can go five minutes, you know, into Longview, and I'm at the college I can watch a lower Columbia play. And so it's local, it's close. Just about anywhere you go in the, in the, in the U.S., with, with some exceptions, you know, some of the more vast states that don't have a lot of population, but pretty much anywhere you go in the Northwest and in California especially, Arizona, Texas, uh, all across the East Coast that area, there is college baseball everywhere, whether it be JUCO, whether it be NAIA, Division Three, Division Two, and Division One. there's baseball everywhere everywhere you can go to so i love the fact that it's local i mean like lower columbia they actually have guys who graduated from the high school that i attended they have guys who graduated from the high school that my wife attended guys from the crosstown rivals guys from you know the greater northwest area but all schools that 
you know, really I've heard of. I played against when I was in high school. So it, it's it's a very local atmosphere, almost kind of a homegrown type of feel. And that's what I love about that. That's why I love the local feeling of college baseball. And once again, that's all across the, the Northwest, all across the country. You see that. So that's number three. That's why I love college baseball because it, it, it is local. Number four on my list of why college baseball is my favorite and why I think it's the best, the games are quicker. One, you're not going to get a lot of radio and TV timeouts in between innings, slowing things down. Uh, the game, you get in, you get the outs, you get out. You get in, you know, it's in and out, in and out, in and out. Much quicker, much faster pace, and I love that about college baseball. You know, I can go to a doubleheader uh, in Longview, and, you know, first game maybe takes two hours. Second game, because usually it's a seven-inning game for the second one, so it's a little bit shorter. Now you're talking another two hours at the most, so four hours, and I caught two games. It's It makes it nice. So I love the quickness. I love the fact that it's more of a up-paced type of atmosphere for the game. And once again, you don't have all the in-between inning stuff, so it doesn't slow it down or spread it out. Okay, number five, and this is one of the big things. You are right on top of the field. You are close to the field, the players, everything. The only levels in which you can do this really are Little League, uh, Babe Ruth, high school, and college ball. Now, there are some, once again, there are some exceptions to this rule. Uh, there are some places where D1 school, they're in a real stadium, and you can't get down that close. But for the most part, for the average college baseball team, you're right there on the fence. You're right there next to the dugout. Uh, at Laura Columbia, where I, once again, where I cover most of my games college wise, even if I'm not photo photographing the games, I can sit right behind the dugout and lean on the dugout. I can sit right behind home plate against the net. You know, I can do that, and that's anyone can do that. Those seats are open to anyone, and that's pretty common across college baseball all across the U.S. So you're right there on the field, great seats, nowhere is bad. Uh, it just It's a great opportunity to be right there, a part of the game as a fan, watching what's going on. So number six. There's a lot more talking at the college level. I love when players are vocal and interacting with each other and cheering each other on. I love hearing that. At the major league level, let's be honest, you don't hear that a lot. At the minor league level, you, you just don't hear it very much. Guys haven't had time to really build relationships and know each other. And it's kind of a, it's a job atmosphere because that's, that's their job. And so guys are expected to do stuff, expected to succeed expected to know what their roles are and you don't hear the team chatting it up as much uh little league you know teams are the guys are still too young to really be that vocal interactive uh babe ruth you start to hear it high school you hear it but really college is where players are the most vocal talking to each other cheering each other on and i like that i love that part of college baseball i love that excitement that enthusiasm just the atmosphere of hearing the players just going nuts when something happens in the game. And I, I love that. I love that part of college baseball. Now, guys, number seven, this is the last part of why I think college baseball is the best, and that's the learning opportunities. Because you are so close to the field, because you are so close to the coaches and the, the players, you have the opportunity to learn a lot. Because at college baseball, the coaches are taking guys from high school who were great athletes, great baseball players, but the college level, they're just another player. They have a lot of room to grow, a lot of room to improve. And college coaches really are teachers more than a lot of the other levels, especially minor league and major league. Coaches there, you know, they coach, they help guys improve, tweak that things. But really the college level is where the most instruction happens at the high level. And so I love being able to sit next to the dugout sit next to the field and hear coaches when they stop a player and explain to them what they should have been seeing, what they should have been doing, why they were doing that, why they didn't do that. There's a lot more instruction and a lot more learning opportunities to, as a fan at the college level. And I, I love that. Honestly, when I'm, when I'm photographing games and one of the coaches grabs a player to, to explain to them something that's going on, something they could have seen or done better, Man, I usually get lost in that and don't even take photographs during that time. I just stop and listen because there is some stuff that I've learned that just 
I loved it. I loved hearing it, loved learning it. Even though I'm not playing anymore, just being able to learn that and be able to understand the mindset of those who have gone to a higher level and played, it, it's awesome for me. It's awesome. So I love, especially covering the NWAC tournament, because you got really the eight best teams in the conference all playing for a championship. I love jumping from dugout to dugout to photograph, but also to stop and listen to each of the coaches as they talk about pitching or hitting or how they're running or how they should be leading off or what things they're looking for in a pickoff move or, or how the catcher is catching and not catching, throwing and not. All that, I love that. I love the learning aspect of baseball and that's why I love the college level more than any other level. I love it more than Little League. I love it more than high school, more than minor league baseball, and more than major league baseball. College is the sweet spot of baseball for me. It's, it is the sweet spot. I love it. It's right there. You got talent once again. It's affordable. But you also have this learning side of it as well. So talent and learning combined, man, it's just so much fun. It is so much fun. If you've never made it to a college baseball game, go find a, a local junior college in your area. I'm sure the tickets aren't going to be that expensive. There might be some schools, maybe in Arizona, California, Florida, Texas, that are a little more expensive to go to. But I would bet that most junior colleges aren't going to cost you that much to go to, to watch a game. No, it just, I don't think they're going to cost that much. It, they're small junior colleges. It's what they're designed for is to be uh, affordable and be baseball open to the fans so check it out guys you know it took me a long time before i went to my first college game i was actually man probably like 26 27 before i went to my first college game because i never realized you know just how awesome and you know what all it involved but now that i've gone to college games man i never want to stop never want to stop even if not any know-it-all gets shut down i'm still going to go watch baseball games at the college level because it's fun it's fun. It's awesome. So guys, those are my seven reasons why I think college baseball is the best experience level and fan for fans. You know what? It's just my thoughts. Leave a comment down below on what level you prefer to watch. So that way I can see and give me your reasons why as well. So guys, I'm Josh, the 980 Know-It-All, and I will talk to you guys on the next 980 Baseball Talk. See you later.